What's up, people? It's your boy Known coming at y'all another video. Uh, just come to inform y'all that the Tigers. This is this is what we gonna be getting into today. Uh, well, the Tigers have officially announced that after this year, Brad Osmus will be no longer a Tigers manager. Uh, they announced that today. They decided to move on. I think his contract. I'm not sure if I'm correct. Ran through 2017 and. He's no longer coming back. That was made by Alavila. Reasons being because they didn't win. Uh, I know a lot of people, especially in DV, are tremendously happy about this scenario. But, I mean, come on, man. It's not. Yeah, he to blame for some of the stuff. But, I mean, come on, man. I think Alavila himself has a little bit to do with it. Uh, Kind of make you miss my illich. I'll tell you that much. It's kind of make you miss my illich running the scenario. I'm sorry, excuse me. Uh, Thing is, man, I know everybody didn't like Brad Osmus. Uh, I don't know sport baseball that entirely great. I'm still getting into it because, like I said, it's a long-ass game to watch. And, you know, but, you know, my thing is, I don't know if he's to blame for every single little drip of a thing. Yeah, he's to blame for a lot of stuff. It's a lot of stuff Brad Osmus is dead. I know I was about to say Brad Osmus because that's what a lot of people call him. But, you know, I mean, hey, uh some of the stuff that can be blamed on the talent we had through here as well. You know what I'm saying? The pitchers should have showed up. Our batters should have showed up in more critical times. Like, how is it that – you got to understand this, people. How is it that they leaving? And come on. My bad, people. I had to take care of something. Uh, yeah, where was I saying? Uh, yeah, you know, it, it's – I mean, it's what you expected. I expected this to happen. I just didn't expect it to, you know – come and hear this today, you know, when I woke up, I didn't expect to hear this, but, uh, yeah, man, you know, I mean, at the end of the day, like I said, he can be blamed for some stuff, and it's a lot of stuff he can't be blamed for, 50-50, I know a lot of old, it's a lot of old school people who don't like it, and some that I know of, they don't like it, then, you know, you got a lot of young guys that, you know, want his ass gone, but my thing is, Alavila, this is the test for him, what are you going to do to find us a competent manager? And that's the big question of Ali. And who out there? Is anybody suggest anybody? Leave it in the comment section, man. Who you think we should hire? Uh, who you think we should sign? Uh, as far as talent, uh, I was also saying too something about some of all the players that they should have did more. Yeah, so that's where I left off at. Yeah, I should. Left, that's where they kind of you know uh, they they should have did better. The batters, you know, you you getting y'all some of the most highest paid guys to step on the field. Y'all going away now to new teams and balling the fuck out for what I'm here. And y'all could not do this for us for some reason. Some people might blame Brad Osmus again for somehow for that. Uh, I just leave that up in the air. I really don't care. You know, at that at this point, uh, the damage has been done. Uh, uh, might as well clean house entirely as far as the office, the front office, and Al Vila himself. But this. I just leave in the comment section, man, how y'all feel about it, man. Who y'all think they should bring up in here uh, as far as manager and who they should go out and try to sign their trades for because we ain't got nothing but a bunch of loose-ass uh, women on the team now. So after all the bad trades we just made. So, yeah, this is your boy, no, man. Y'all leave it in the comment section. Peace.